Hello. The sun is setting behind the hills. The river is flowing gently. The tall grasses are swaying in the wind. And crickets are singing their happy song. And I'm trying to see what kind of flowers and creatures I can spot. And I just spotted a cute little dude. Hello! There you go. Cute little grasshopper having a rest. I wonder what you're thinking about. Now, is there anybody else I can see? I really enjoy just looking at the flowers. There's always so many pretty things, like there's a lot there. Can you hear it? It's very close to me. There's loads of wild thyme as well. Look, that's all wild thyme as far as the eye can see. Let me show it to you from up close. There we go. Oops! <laughs> Don't know if the camera caught it, but there was a, another grasshopper just hopping away. And some different kind of flowers. I'm not sure if it picks the mic if it picks up the sound but I can hear frogs in the distance so I'm gonna try go that way just came closer to the river as well checking if I can see any little limbs I can see some tracks at the bottom. I don't know if it shows. But um, I will be having a video about the creatures that leave the tracks. So look out for that. There's a small dog rose bush. They have been blossoming in the last week or so. This one still has a few blooms and I can see a few baby ones. Now you can find them in different colors. Last time I found a bush that had pale pink flowers. This one is white. Beautiful as well. And some yellow flowers. of grasshoppers but obviously as soon as I come close they will jump away and some beautiful tall daisies oh you're lovely let's have a look at you up close look at that how pretty it is mm, the little purple oops and let's go down to the river. Lots of pebbles. And there they are. 
water is crystal clear again it gets murky sometimes when it, rain when it rains a lot but I like coming here just staring at the water it's very relaxing and then you look up and you have a view like this now is that beautiful or is that beautiful <laughs> i love it oopsie there we go I was hoping that I'll get to show you more creatures today, but it looks like not. Many things are hiding as the evening has come. Oh, did you hear that? It was the frogs. But if you're interested in insects, bugs and other littlelings, do check out my playlist called Little Creatures. I have filmed all sorts of interesting ones and I hope you will like it. Oops, there was a butterfly. All gone now. Okay, I did find a little friend. Come on, focus. No. And a different purple. I've not shown you before. Look at that beauty. I just spotted a bumblebee, but it's gone. Oh, look, there's so many beautiful flowers. There was a little evening butterfly. Where are you? There it is. Completely camouflaged. And the hoverfly. Can we see you? Yeah, there you go. Now hover for us a bit. <laughs> And I found a dog rose bush with pink flowers. There we go. They have closed up for the evening. But they will welcome their guests again tomorrow. More flowers. And even more. Now, I have filmed individual videos about almost everything that I encounter, both little creatures and flowers and plants and trees. So, yet again, just go and check out those playlists if you're interested in any of them. I just spotted an interesting one. I think it's a juvenile. A long type of white plum moth. I have filmed a video about it, I think last year sometime, of an adult. And it was absolutely beautiful. This one is very small and very thin, you can barely see it. But I'm sure that that's the same thing. Uh, check that out. I'm gonna put it in the description or in the thingy up on the top right corner So you can see the video of it because it's very interesting When I first saw it, I thought oh I discovered the new creature Because <laughs> I've never seen one before Anyway, that's it for today Because it's starting to get dark and I still need to get home So wishing you all a uh, very good evening, night, good morning or good day, wherever you are. <laughs> Bye!